officially going live. Uh, I'm gonna fix the camera. Uh, it's fine. Oh, let me just lower my seat. Oh, my seat is as low as it goes. Um, hey guys, welcome to this uh, impromptu stream. Um, I, I guys, I still plan on streaming. I still have the intentions on streaming tomorrow. Um, I'm doing this stream for a few reasons. Um, for starters, I, I did not sleep at all last night. Um, I hate saying um. I I stayed up way too late, and I was you know just had energy, so I you know sat at my desk trying to figure out. Uh, sent, sending up a whole bunch of stuff that I would like on OBS for future streams and like just, just fiddling with a whole bunch of stuff because I want to like change my, my setup on my desk. I want things to be a little bit more organized because it is an unholy mess and I I just wanted that to look a little bit better and by the time that I was, you know, just I gave up on it, it was like 6.30 this morning, I tried to go to sleep again, my my first alarm went off at like 7.30, and then my second alarm went off at 8.30, and I, I just gave up on just going to sleep, so to try to keep myself awake, you know, I did a bunch of housework. Uh, still tired. Um, it's late enough in the evening to probably have dinner, and I like food's not going to be sufficient enough. So I figured, um, I I figured I'd have dinner, and you know give you guys some content. Don't worry, this isn't a mukbang. Um, as you can tell by the title, we are doing a Pokemon hot sauce cha Nuzlocke challenge. So for those of you who don't know what a Nuzlocke is, in it's a special set of rules that you play when by when you play Pokemon. The rules are simple. You first of all you have to name every Pokemon that you obtain. Starter doesn't matter. If you can nickname it, you have to nickname it. Second rule, you can only catch the first Pokemon you encounter on each route. If you fail to capture it, you do not get a Pokemon on that route. So like, for the OG Pokemon players, if you are on Route 1, you fail to catch a Pidgey, you can no longer catch a Pokemon on Route 1. You have to go to Route 2 and so on and so forth. If a Pokemon faints in a Nuzlocke, normally you have to let it go. But that's where we're mixing up things a little bit differently. For Christmas, I was given a a, a, a hot sauce set. Um, ranging from, like, no heat at all to you're going to regret every decision you've ever made in your life hot. So what we're going to do in this one-off stream is if one of my Pokemon faints, I have the option to pour some on one of my little cheeky nuggies and eat eat the nugget to save the Pokemon. Now, every time I do that, I have to go up in intensity of the heat so by my fourth or fifth uh pokemon my fourth or fifth nugget hopefully it won't get that bad um my my mouth is going to be burning i don't have any milk i don't have anything to like tone down the heat i sampled a couple of these sauces um, last week and even at like the two star rating there's a bit of a kick to it it goes up to four, four or five, and it's 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 gonna be a tough one. So we're gonna try really, really hard. Not, I mean, if a Pokemon faints, I can still choose to let it faint. And as soon as we start getting to like the, you know, my mouth is feeling numb, my lips are tingly, we may start doing that. The run is over if I lose. All of my Pokemon. There's no Pokemon in my party. There's no Pokemon my, in my PC. I have run out of chicken nuggets because I only have 12 nuggets because there are only 12 sauces. Or my mouth is just in so much pain that like I physically cannot go on. Like I have to run and like put some snow or something like on my face to to fix my body. Because again, I mean, I'm going to put this out here right now. Guys, it is not worth harming your body for content. Like, it's it's not worth it. But with that being said, let's dive on in. Staring at the sauce, staring at the nuggets, and guys, I am I am terrified. My name is Rowan. However, everyone calls me the Pokemon Professor. 
This world is wild, widely inhabited by creatures known as Pokemon. This is my fat boy. Fat boy Jr. We humans live alongside Pokemon as friends. At times we play together and at other times we work together. Some people use their Pokemon to battle and develop closer bonds with them. What do I do? I conduct research so that they may so that we may learn more about Pokemon and test hair sample products. Now why don't you tell me a little bit about yourself? I am a man. I'm a scared man because I'm about to destroy my face with hot sauce. So we're gonna call myself Mr. Fancy. Actually. He was right. Let's give myself a proper name. Mr. Fancy. Your name is Mr. Fancy? Why, yes, yes it is. Okay, so you're Mr. Fancy. A fine name, that is. Now, this boy here, I believe he is your friend. What might his name be? I'll tell you. Okay, guys, do not judge me. There is a reason I am giving him this name. You guys will notice immediately why he, his name is this. <laughs> ADHD, is that your friend's name? Yes. All right, Mr. Fancy, the time has come. Your very own tale of grand adventure is about to unfold on your journey. You will meet countless Pokemon and people. I'm sure that along the way you'll discover many things, perhaps even something about yourself, like my tolerance to heat. <laughs> now go on and leap into the world of Pokemon. Breaking news! Despite the exploration team's best efforts, the rare, oddly colored Pokemon eluded detection. The rumored Red Gyarados failed to appear, even fleetingly, to the crestfallen team. Oh, I still hate how bulbous my head is. And that concludes our report on the Red Gyarados, brought to you by Jubilife TV on Nationwide Net. See you next week, same time, same channel. It's my little switch. What am I playing? Well, I know I I know it's a switch, but what am I playing? What's on TV? Okay. Um. All right. We're not gonna stop. We're just gonna we're just gonna dive right on in. It's my mama. Mr. Fancy, ADHD came calling for you a little while ago. I don't know what it, it was about, but he said it was an emergency. I don't know if you guys can hear the music, which is so dumb, because I spent a good while trying to figure out, like, why the audio wasn't working. Oh, yeah, don't go into tall grass. It'd be fine if you had your own Pokemon, but you don't. Well, joke's on you, Mama. I am a grown man, and I will do as I please. Done. What was that about? Oh, hey, Mr. Fancy. I'm gonna go to the lake. You should come too and be quick about it. Okay, Mr. Fancy, I'm finding you one million dollars if you're late. Oh, jeez, I forgot something. All right. Oh. Oh, hi, Mr. Fancy. Are you looking for ADHD? He was gone for a second, but he came running back home. He just can't sit still, that boy. I wonder who he takes after. Mm. Actually, I know who his dad is, and it's super weird because I don't get the same vibes. I better take my bag and guidebook, too. Oh, hey, Mr. Fancy. We're going to the lake. I'll be waiting for you on the road. It's a $10 million fine if you're late. Oh, just to make this more interesting, I am not allowed to use healing items 
at like at all. Like I have to go to a Pokemon Center. Hey, I saw the news. Hey, you saw the news report that was on TV, right? You know, search for the Red Gyarados, the mysterious appearance of the furious Pokemon in a lake. The show got me thinking. I bet our local lake has a Pokemon like that in it too. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go find a Pokemon like that. Follow me. Boy, you both need to fix your hair. Like, I have, like, make-out hair. Just get out of bed hair. That boy, I don't know what he's doing. What's going on? Professor, there isn't anything out of the ordinary on the other side either. Hmm. I may have been mistaken. Something appears to be different than it was before, but... Fine. It's... It's enough. We have... So we have seen the lake. Blah. My reading comprehension, top notch. Don, we're leaving. Professor, how are you enjoying being back in Sinnoh after being away for four years? It must be exciting again. Aww. There is one thing I can say. There are many rare kinds of Pokemon in Sinnoh. The region should serve us very well in regard to our studies. Excuse me, let us pass, please. Mm, I beg your pardon, we'll be on our way. Girl, you can walk by. Old man, you know what, respect for my elders. You didn't disrespect me. You can pass. You can pass too, it's fine. What? Don't go into the tall grass. No problem, no problem. We won't be in there long enough for a wild Pokemon to come out. It was that day he learned he done goofed. It's a briefcase. Those people forgot it here. What are we supposed to do with it? We can try to return it, but who were they? I heard them say, Professor. And we get jumped. What? Pokemon? What's going on? And now we commit burglary. Well, I guess theft? Uh... There we go. I want my... I want my turtle. Alright. While Starly has appeared. <laughs> go to Twig! Whose name will change next chance we get? Oh, I was like super scared for a second because I thought I hit the wrong move. I think it's, like, physically impossible to, like, actually lose your first quote-unquote battle in the newer games, which I find kind of annoying. Like, I remember, like, back on the Game Boy, Game Boy Color, like, you had to fight for that victory. You had to strategize for that first win. And you felt like a god if you got it. And you, you just don't get that anymore, which is super sad. Which is much bummer. I got experience points. Yay. I'm not worthless. But my Chimchar was tougher than yours. They were other people's Pokemon. But we had to use them. Those people won't mind, will they? Oh, we're going to get beaten within an inch of our lives. Because we stole some old man's Pokemon. Oh, the professor would be furious if I had lost it. Huh? Oh, no. Did... Did, did you use the Pokemon that were in here? You did? Oh my gosh, what's the professor going to say? This is so not good. I'll take this briefcase for now. Hey, girl. Girl, can I get your number? What was that about? I don't know what's going on, Mr. Fancy. Get out of here. My Pokemon got hurt from battle. If we get attacked by another Pokemon, we... Boy, you might be in trouble. I am a legend. I am a straight-up legend. You do not disrespect me like that by saying, Oh, we might be in trouble. No, no, there is no we in this. You go on ahead. I know we have to go return the Pokemon. They're not ours, but I want to spend just a little more time with the little guy. Hey, it's the people. Is that old guy staring at us? Uh, I don't know. He's not blinking. So I guess he is staring at us. 
I heard from Don that used our Pokemon. Let me see them, please. Turtwig and Chimchar. Hmm, I see. That's how it is. Done. I'm going back to my lab. Um, okay, Professor. Please wait for me. I think you should visit our lab later. Okay, see you. What was all that craziness about? I mean, if he wasn't angry, he could have just yelled at us or whatever, but he didn't. And he didn't want his Pokemon back. Mr. Fancy, we should go home too. No, I don't want to go home because Mama's going to heal my mom. I mean, I didn't really take any damage, but I'm, I'm looking at the Nuggies and I'm kind of hungry. And I want to suffer a little bit. What's up, dear? Wow, I can't believe that it happened to you. Am I ever glad that both you and ADHD are unharmed? The professor you mentioned is most likely Professor Rowan of Sanjum Town. I've heard that he is well known for his studies on Pokemon. I hear he's also quite intimidating. Did you see his mustache? That is an intimidating mustache. I think you need to visit him in Sanjum Town. You need to properly explain why you had no choice but to use his Pokemon. Don't worry, I'm sure he'll understand. He is going to smack me with his ring hand. Oh, I know, Mr. Fancy. Put these on. You received a pair of running shoes. Going to Sanjum Town is like an adventure in itself, right? With those running shoes, you can get to faraway places much faster. Okay, let me read the instructions. Move. If you move at all faster than your normal walk, you are now running. Congratulations. I'm sorry, but I'm not going to read the dialogue on how to... Oh, we're going to change a couple things. Options. Fast. And then... That is... Good. Yes. All right. Oh, did you give us a potion? Oh wait, no, we're not allowed to use potions. We can only use Pokemon centers because, again, we want we want to make this, gotta make this a challenge. And guys, I'm not gonna stay here and grind. Like we're we're just gonna just we're just gonna blaze through. Also, to make sure that my nuggies they're already like room temp. I mean, at least they're cooked. Which again. I refuse to use withdraw. Like, I, I, I have never used withdraw in the newer games in my entire life. I don't use growl. I just go straight for the offensive. I have no time for such, such baby nonsense. There we go. I gain experience points. Yay. Just trying to get a little bit more comfortable. We've made it to Sanjim Town. Oh, hi there. Please come with me. The professor wants to talk with you. This is it. Our Pokemon Research Lab. Let's go. Good. Wait, oh, hey, Mr. Fancy, that old guy, he's not scary as so much as he is totally out there. Ah, oh, it doesn't matter, Mr. Fancy, I'm out of here. See you later. Wow, is that, your friend seems to be really impatient. Well, anyway, go inside. Finally, you've come, Mr. Fancy. Was it? Let me see that Pokemon again. Hmm, this Pokemon seems to be rather happy already. Then I'll give you that Turtwig as a gift. Oh, would you like to give it a nickname? Yes, because I'm required by law. Turt. Russell. Nope. There we go. Are you happy with that nickname? Yes. Remember to see that there is a growing bond between you and your Pokemon through it, though it is still young. That is why I would like to entrust you with Turtwig. I'm so glad that if it, if you weren't, I, I just I just can't say it. 
guys, I'm so sorry that I'm skipping dialogue. I'm just so not used to like just reading it, especially like out loud, because I've played this game like a thousand times. Ahem. Let's move on to the main topic. There is something I want you to do for me. My name is Rowan. I study Pokemon. First of all, I want you to know exactly what kind of Pokemon live in the Sinnoh region. To do so, it is necessary to collect data using the Pokedex. This is what I wish to ask of you. I want to entrust you with this Pokedex. Will you use it in, to record the data on all the Pokemon in Sinnoh for me? Sure, why not? Good answer. You obtain the Pokedex. That Pokedex is a very high-tech device. It will automatically record data on every kind of Pokemon you encounter. Mr. Fancy, I ask that you go everywhere and meet every kind of Pokemon in this region. I've got one too. Yeah, you got Piplup. When you walked, uh, walked up to 201 with your Pokemon, what did you feel? I've lived for 60 long years. Even now, I get a thrill when I'm with a Pokemon. Now you should know that there are countless Pokemon in this world. That means there are just as many thrills waiting for you out there. Now go! Mr. Fancy, your grand adventure begins right now. The Pokemon that I used for the first time was Piplup. I told you! If you would have chosen Piplup at the lake, we'd have the same Pokemon now. No, no, we would not. If I chose Piplup, you would have gotten uh, Chimchar. But that's how this works. Not that it matters, but anyways, I'm done. I also help the Pokem help the professor add pages to the Pokedex. So in a sense, I'm just like you. I just got a little head start on you, that's all. I'll be happy to teach you things. Glad to meet you, Mr. Fancy. Can we... Oh, we got a view. Hey, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. We have yet to suffer through the hot sauce quite yet. But hopefully we'll, we'll risk losing him on soon. Um, just to catch you up, we're doing a Hot Sauce Nuzlocke challenge. So if a Pokemon faints, I have the ability to eat one chicken nugget with uh, various levels of Hot Sauce that I have off to the side um, in order to keep my Pokemon alive. It is ba Other than that, it's basically your normal Pokemon Nuzlocke challenge. I've got a bit more experience than you as a trainer and as a professor's assistant. Okay, follow me. Yeah, I know. This Pokemon Center, the Red Roof, this place where heals Pokemon. Oh, I'm also not allowed to use potions in battle or healing moves. I have to use the Pokemon Center um, just because I, like, th these are the new Pokemon games. Like, they are not hard. You gotta, you gotta make it as hard as you possibly can. There's a shop where you can buy and sell items and medicine. Mr. Fancy, since you're a novice trainer, you won't be able to buy many kinds of merchandise. But don't let that bother you. Oh, that's right, Mr. Fancy. Don't you need to let your family know that you're going to help be helping Professor Rowan with the Pokedex? You may need to travel pretty far, so I think you should let somebody know. Oh, but before you go, heal up your Pokemon at the Pokemon Center. It'll be a lot... No, we are... No. We are... In fact, I didn't take any damage, so I'm not going to heal. Like, I... Like, I, I want this to be a challenge, so I'm, I'm going to skip that first heal. In fact, I'm, I'm going to like make this even harder. I am not allowed to use a Pokemon Center until I am at least halfway through my health on a Pokemon. Alright, talk to me, Mama. Welcome home, Mr. Fancy. Are you and your Pokemon healthy? Take this no, no, don't heal me, you fool. Yeah, wow, Professor Rowan asked you to do something big? Okay, dear, go for it. Your mom's got your back. Oh, I know, Mr. Fancy. I've got something you'll find useful. You've obtained the guidebook. The guidebook's been the key item bag. Have you ever played Pokemon before? Then you don't need the guidebook. But here, we'll give you this guidebook anyway. You're not going to be alone. You're going to have your partner Pokemon with you forever and ever, unless it dies. When you are exposed to new things and experience new sensations, it makes your mother happy, too. But please come back sometimes. I would like to see the kinds of Pokemon you've caught, dear. Ma'am, you will never see me again. Excuse me, is my little ADHD here? No? No, he's not. 
Then he must have left already. What to do? That boy shouted about going on an adventure, then he bolted. He's so headstrong and reckless, I at least wanted him to take this. Not to worry, Mr. Fancy will receive deliver that to him. Won't you, Mr. Fancy? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. You'll do that for me? Mr. Fancy, please take this to ADHD for me. You've obtained the parcel. You put the parcel in your key items bag. Bye-bye, Mr. Fancy. Enjoy your adventure. Let me think. Knowing my boy, he'd be probably be heading straight to Jubilife City. Okay, please take that to my ADHD. It's his Ritalin. Oh, Mr. Fancy, you've forgotten something important. I don't need a hat! But I'll take it, because apparently I'm obligated to have an ugly hat. Mom, I just want to go on my adventure! <laughs> Yes, the hat always did suit you well, Mr. Fancy. Now off you go. Can I go? Can I go, Mom? <laughs> Guys, that's another thing I hate about the new Pokemon games. Um, the last few years. Um, there's just so much tutorial. And it's just... It's just like, I just want to get started. Like, again, Pokemon, red, blue, yellow, gold, silver, crystal. Like, you get your starter. Hey, I'm Professor Oak. Go catch Pokemon. Go have fun. Like, that that was it. That's all you needed to know, that you were your name, you were a Pokemon trainer, go fill out the Pokedex. And now it's, like, five hours, like, just to get started. Come on. Oh, my gosh. Shirt Russell actually took damage. And it was a crit. That meant nothing. That did nothing. Oh, my attack fell. Cool. That doesn't really matter. You're gonna faint this hit anyway. Oh my gosh, there's still one more stupid tutorial that we have to go through. Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm so angry. I learned leafage. Yay. So I still need to learn how to catch Pokemon. And then... Kind of, we get to start our journey. Guys, like, I keep, like, patting my chicken nuggets. They are, like, getting cold. I I should have gotten through the tutorial before streaming, but you know what? That's okay. Mr. Fancy, I haven't shown you how to catch a Pokemon. I'll demonstrate how to catch one. Just you watch me, okay? All right, I'm not going to read their dialogue, so I'm just going to run it by you if you've never played a Pokemon game before. You, you lower the Pokemon's health, you click on the item bag, you click the Pokeball you want to use, and you throw it. That, that is it. And since I have no choice but to go through the tutorial, um, I will give you guys, uh, I'll just do housekeeping again. Uh, this is a, this is just like a normal Nuzlocke. I can only catch the first Pokemon I encounter on each route. I have to nickname every Pokemon I catch. If a Pokemon faints, I either have to release it, or I can keep that Pokemon alive by eating a chicken nugget with a hot sauce from my hot sauce challenge box. And that's, that's I'm, I'm actually willing to almost throw a battle, like, just so we can get a, a nugget in, because this is also, like, this is also my dinner. <laughs> like, um, as I said at the beginning of the stream, I did not sleep at all. Last night, I'm going on over 24 hours without sleep, haven't even had a nap, and so I'm, I'm just trying to keep myself awake until it is, like, a reasonable time to go to bed, and I figured this would be a great way to kill some time. I did a bunch of house cleaning today. Yeah, I got Pokeballs, but that it just wasn't enough. Okay, we got Pokeballs. All right, let's let's go. All right, first trainer battle. I should be a little weak from that fight with the Bidoof. Totally fine. I mean, I'm still gonna use attacking moves because I I want the the game to keep going. So don't worry, I'm not gonna like. Just use not offensive moves just so I can eat a nugget. Oh my gosh. 
Don't use Growl. I need you to attack me. I need you to use flying type moves. I, I request it, please. You know what? I'm not. I'm. I'm not gonna use. I. I know. I. I made the rule of I'll only use a a Pokemon Center if my Pokemon are under fifty percent health. But guys, I really want the Nugget. I. I want to get like the actual challenge going. And I can't do that if I don't lose a Mon. I'm, I'm I'm actually even like half tempted just to make this a mono. T you know, it's official. This is a mono Turt Russell stream, so we are only allowed to use Turt Russell through the entire and until the the game is over because uh, executive decision. My nuggets are getting cold. I'm I'm not losing. I'm not losing any mons. And you know, it 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 hasn't been a challenge. I'm I'm okay with that. Oh, um, again with the rules, uh, with the hot sauce, the run is over if I, uh, I mean, now that we're only using Turt Russell, it's until I either run out of nuggets or the hot sauce intensity is so bad, I, like, I am in physical pain. Those be the rules. I don't know if I want to use... I, I I don't know if I want to take uh, redact my rule about uh, only using Turt Russell, because really like most of the stream really will have been like just the tutorial, and that's not fun. Like we we want some excitement, so you know what we we will just normal normal Nuzlocke rules, but well obviously with 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 the hot sauce. I'm still really bummed that we can't enjoy the the music of the game. But you know, it's fine. It's not fine, but it's fine. Cool. We are unstoppable gods. We beat last Natalie. Oh, boo! I can't win. Th thank you for the money. That we will probably not be using. I didn't mean to run into a Pokemon. I actually meant to just uh, go up the path. Okay, so we're gonna catch. Uh, we're gonna catch. Oh, and it has Intimidate. I'd, I'd rather have Moxie, but you know what? That's fine. I guess. I mean, in Intimidate's still decent. Cool. We got our first. Uh, our first like actual catch. And. Get experience for it. Chinks will be added to the Pokedex. All of its fur dazzles a dangerous sense that flees while the foe is mom momentarily blind. Would you like to give it a nickname? Yes, because per Nuzlocke rules, I am required to. And we are going to call you Leroy. Leroy's been added to the party. Ooh, let's check out the natures real quick. I know the natures really aren't going to matter. Since this isn't competitive. Check summary. Ooh, that's actually a pretty decent nature. I mean, I'd rather you be a little bit more like bulky defensively. But that that's actually not bad. That is not oh wait, what what are my moves? Uh okay, physical and okay, they're both physical. That's that's good. Oh, we gotta check. We gotta check Leroy. Uh Shinx. Ooh, okay, okay, okay. Okay, we're we're getting pretty decent natures. Let's have a Pokemon battle, but I'm going to win. Sir, I can almost guarantee you that you will not. We're not going to switch out because I'm going to purposely throw uh, the Bidoof for the Nuggie. And the, the cool thing about the hot sauce is, like, it's hot sauces from, like, around the world. So, like, I'll tell you the flavor and, like, what country it's from. Because, you know, that's going be a bit, bit of fun. Be a bit of fun. Wow, it's not very effective. Yeah, I, 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 I am aware. 
All right, we are getting... All right, I think this next turn, we're going to take our first nugget. Guys, I'm actually really excited for the first nugget. Not because it's like we're progressing with the challenge, but also because, again, like, I am hungry. And my nuggies... Okay. Ter Russell has fainted. Um, we will do... We will do the nugget after the battle. We will nugget after battle. Oh! Why did you get a crit? Oh my gosh, why did you get a crit? Okay. Okay, so we're going to continue with the rule where Pokemon has to be, you know, um, around ha half HP to go to the Pokemon Center. And I'm going to eat the first nugget so I don't have to discard Turret Russell. Alright, so we're going to pause real quick. All right, our first hot sauce is lime hot sauce from Brazil. I'm going to grab the nug. And just to dip it. I'm not going to... Okay, you can kind of see the hot sauce. Oh, yeah. Like, there, there's really no spice to it. I mean, there, there's, there's a little bit of a kick to it. But, like, it's, it's, it's more good than, like, ouch. All right. One nuggie down. Oh, is that another trainer? Okay. Oh, you just telling me that only some Pokemon come out at night? All right. Um... No, because we're doing a Nuzlocke. Oh, yeah, we need to go to the uh, go to the trainer school, so that's where we're going to get our next battles. All right, so we actually are going to heal up, so we have our team ready to go. And, guys, for those of you who are new to the new to the channel i actually archive everything on my youtube channel under the same name um, after this goes up i will be sure to post a link to the youtube channel um, in the description so you guys can go and check that out um, i have other playthroughs going on on saturdays i stream hogwarts legacy and on wednesdays i stream uh, various board games um, on wednesday we played clubhouse 51 on the nintendo switch and we played the mario party a few other games we like to have fun here. We like to mix things up every now and again. All right. We are going off to the trainer school. Let's fight the kids first. That way we can get some more battles in, hopefully some more nuggets. All right, Abra, you're at the goal. Go, Tote Russell. All right. Okay, that did literally nothing. Okay, and I don't think I got the yellow. Okay, perfect. Right. Still did nothing even with the special attack boost. What's it like to be sad? All right. Turt Russell's at eight. Leroy's at five. All right. Beat Kid Harrison. Oh, snap. That's how it is then. Got $408. All right. So we're going to do. Is we are gonna swap uh, Leroy and Turt Russell because I mean the first few couple of sauces like it's not like 
Like, the, the, the game is easy, so, like, I'm willing to throw a few matches to, like, up the ante later on in the game. All right, we are going up against School Kids Christine. Also has an Abra. Um, I can't remember if she also has Charge Beam or if it's, like, in the original War. I think they get hit in power. I, 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 I can't remember. It's actually been a minute since I've played um, Diamond and, I mean, Brilliant Diamond and Shining, Shining Pearl. Okay, that's going to do nothing because I, I resist because we're both, because that's an electric move on electric. It's fine. That literally did nothing. Not very effective. All right, Thundershock. Lego. Oh, we got the yellow. Oh, you tried to use Thunder Wave. Um, yeah, they changed that in new generations where you can't like use Thunder Wave and stuff like that on electric type Pokemon. And you can't poison steel types. Or burn fire types. Which I guess makes sense, but still kind of interesting. Alright, we've lost Leroy. Except we're gonna eat the nugget. I actually thought I had more health than that. All right, Turt Russell, let's go. All right. Abra has fainted. Turt Russell's almost at nine. Defeated kid, school kid Christine. I like to study a lot. I like to thought he'd win. Again, $408. It's not bad. Uh, you were actually confident that we'd be do pretty good, but I'm completely impressed by how tough you are. Talk to my friend. Okay, talk to him. Get the DM. Let's find out. Uh, I don't think. I think it is hard to be. Oh, that's right. You get like multiple TMs this time in this version. Oh, it's work up. That's useless. Uh, boy, that is free money. All right, so we lost. We lost Leroy, so we're all, we're gonna grab our second sauce. All right, second sauce is jalapeno hot sauce from Mexico. All right. Oh, that's a bit more than I wanted. Okay, you can hopefully see the little glisten. Oh. I gotta be careful because I do not want to get hot sauce on my computer. Uh, there's the ki okay. Okay, now we're starting to get a little bit of heat. Okay, that's why we're here. That is why we are here. All right. All right. Let's heal up. Keep the team going. Guys, I'm actually like really scared because like I'm I'm good I'm just gonna keep hot sauce. <laughs> I am not willing to to lose Mons. Alright. And and we're we're still at like the at one star and it looks like the hot sauce does go up to an intensity of four. Oh, where's the oh, I, I still need to talk to uh Still need to go talk to ADHD. I was so excited to get my next battle underway. To get more hot sauce. Hey, Mr. Fancy, did you come to study too? I went ahead and memorized everything that was on the blackboard. After all, it's the trainer's job to avoid having their precious Pokemon hurt in battle. So, Mr. Fancy, what brings you here? You got something for me? Yes, it is your medication. So what is it? Oh, it's a town map. Huh. There are two in here. I like it a lot, but I don't need two. Here, Mr. Fancy, you take one. I will not be needing that map. Hmm, well, according to the ta town map, I guess Orberg City is where I should be going next. There's a gym, so it'll be perfect for raising Pokemon I just caught. Well, I'm on the road to becoming the greatest trainer of all time. See you around.
Alright, more tutorial. Oh, you're a Pokemon trainer? But you don't have a Poketech yet. Do you want your smartwatch? Yes, I would love my smartwatch. Oh, you are rare case indeed. You see, I invented and now manufacture Poketex. Not only that, I am now conducting the Poketech promotional campaign. All you have to do is find three clowns in Jubilife. If you can find them, I'll give you your very own Poketech. Great. I know where all the clowns are. Hi, I'm Pokedex Campaign Clown. Let's roll out my question. Does a Pokemon grow by defeating others and gaining experience points? That is correct. You are absolutely correct. Pokemon grow stronger by defeating other Pokemon in battle. Some Pokemon even change into a different Pokemon through a process known as evolution. Here you go. Here's your Poketech coupon. I paid my first coupon. And then the next one... I'm actually really, really bummed that they didn't have the the GTS tower over here, like actually up and running in the remakes, because it was it was really interesting to like hop into the the GTS and see like what people wanted for like their for, for like their Shinx. It'd be like, oh yeah, I'll give you my level five Shinx if you give me like your your legendary Pokemon. It has to be like level one hundred. Alright, clown number two. Hi, I'm a Pokedex clown camp campaign clown. Let's roll out my question. Can a Pokemon hold an item? Yes, my Pokemon will not be holding items because we're not babies. Ding ding, you are absolutely correct. A Pokemon may hold a single item. Some items become effective as soon as they are held by a Pokemon. Berries are eaten by Pokemon as necessary during battle. Here you go. Here's your Pokedex coupon. You will pay coupon number three. Okay, three is in the key item pocket, and then last clown is right here. Hi, I'm a Pokedex campaign clown. Let's roll up my question. Just like Pokemon, do the moves also have types? That is correct. Ding, ding, you're absolutely correct. If a Pokemon type matches that type of move, that move is made much more powerful through stab or same type attack bonus. Here's your Pokedex coupon. Bada bing, bada boom. Put coupon number two in your key bag. And let's go talk to Rich. Let's go talk to Steve Jobs. Steve, talk to me. Okay, let me count your coupons. Let's just pull up the Pope, Pokedex here. One, two, and three. Bravo. I say bravo. In return for these coupons, I present you with this Pokemon Watch or Poketech for short. Yay, we got our smartwatch. Can it? I mean, it does track your steps. Can it tell me the weather? Okay, get some apps. Make it more versatile. Um, go away. All right. That is... Ooh, we're actually finding our rival this time. Ooh, are we going to get two nuggets? Oh, I think we're going to get two nuggets. Oh, I'm also implementing dupes clause. So if I catch a, if the Pokemon has a little Pokeball by it, it means I've already caught it. it. Means I can't catch it again. So if I'm in this route, I run into a Shinx, I can avoid that encounter and look for something like Starly. Uh, now we're gonna go to tackle because I want more Nuggy. Okay, that did, like, absolutely nothing. Alright, we're going to tackle three times, and then we're going to use Thunder Shock. Leroy, use Tackle! Ugh. Like, guys, this is what I'm talking about when, like, the newer Pokemon games are just so easy. Like, I am intentionally throwing matches, and I'm still doing fine. Like, it is, it is ridiculous. And, bop. Leroy's at level 7. Turt Russell's at level 9. ADHD, we want to bring out Chimchar. Do we want to change? No, we're going to stick with Leroy Battle. 
Jago. Fight me, you monkey coward. Well, at least I'm not missing anything. That makes me feel a little bit better. See, now, chat, if the AI was intelligent, he would have scratched, and he probably would have knocked out my Shinx. But because it's new Pokemon games, they really, like, hold your hand, like... Oh no 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 no! Like we 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 want to make sure that you that you feel good. Guys, I'm winning to throw Leroy. I want that third nugget. I want to I want to keep the the sauce going. My Pokemon's HP low is low and could be. Yeah, it's why you would. Thank you. Oh my gosh, thank you. Okay, we've lost Leroy. Uh, we're going to grab sauce number three in just a second. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to, like, throw until, like, we're out of, like, the one-star range and then come, like, the two-star range for the hot sauce. I think I'll actually try, like, a little bit harder to, like, be a competent player. Oh, boy. All right, critical hit. Chimchar fainted. Turret rustles at ten. Learn growth. I will never use growth. Beat ADHD. You would have won a little. Well, you would have lost sooner, but you decided. What? What do you mean I lost? It means you spent like half the game using Leer. You could have done anything else. Yeah, 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 you're going to be the world's toughest trainer. The first thing I'm going to do is take on Orberg City Pokemon Jam. I'm going to toughen up for that totally. Well, fortunately, I kind of have type advantage. Now, normally, if you really want to get through, like, the first gym with, like, no problems, you just grab Chimchar. But I didn't grab Chimchar. I grabbed Tur Russell because we like turtles. I mean, don't get me wrong, I like basically all the animals that this generation are based off of, but, you know, I, 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 wanted, I wanted Turt Russell. Okay, we hope to see you again. All right, so we're going to leave. All right, we're going to grab nugget number three. All right, we got America's Wild West Buffalo, so we're just going to say, like, well, America. All right, grab the nug. lid on with one hand. Alright. You can tell that there is a little bit of sauce. Okay, the jalapeno had more had more kick to it. But we are officially three sauces in. Ooh, let's, uh, I think we can go over here, catch another Mon. Oh, I think over here we can get Magikarp? Yeah. Okay, so yeah, we're gonna grab the old rod, we're gonna grab Magikarp. No, I didn't mean to talk to you. And I'm I'm still kind of in the phase where I can, I guess, technically throw matches, um, especially with Magikarp, since it, they won't actually know how to really do anything. Besides Splash. Hey, why... Come 
All right, fine. Bag. Easy item. I really don't remember how to use the... Easy item. Come on. Oh, I think I remember. I think I remember. Bag. Register. Guys, I want a Magikarp. Not it. Oh. Alright, we're gonna try one more time. Alright, one more time. If we don't get it, then we're just gonna give up and keep moving forward because it's ridiculous if I do not have a Magikarp yet all right screw Magikarp can I fight you oh nope I, I don't want to hear about you and your love life I do not care Um, I think I can move, go up, and grab another Mon. Okay, yeah, yeah, new route. Okay, route 204. Uh, what are we getting in 204? Alright, so like I said, we already caught Shinx. Um, I mean, I'll, I'll, I'll fight it for the experience. You know what, no, we're, we're, just, we're just gonna run, we're just gonna run. Because I'm not going to get enough experience for for the time wasted to be worth it. So we need anything but... Sh okay, Starly. Okay. Let's go, Leroy. All right, I already know what I'm going to call Starly. Um, let's go. Starly will be added to the Pokedex. The f they flock in great numbers. Though small, they flap their wings with great power. Would you like to nickname your Starly? Yes. It's not creative, but we dig it. All right, Pokemon. Swap Pokemon. That way you get a bit more experience. Oh, go grab that item. Oh, can't get it yet. Oh wait, yeah, again, I just gotta be smart. Ah, oh, we missed out on Bidoof. It's okay, we'll probably get Bidoof the next route because I pretty much got like all the opening route mons. You know what? Kicks and giggles because I can. Well, at least get a little experience going for you. I know I said I wasn't going to fight Shinx on Shinx, but you know what? Kill a little time. It's fine. I want to see how tough my Miss Star is. Oh, sweet pajama mamas. I think there's a couple of trainers up here, so I think I will fight those trainers while I'm up here. Get them out of the way, and then we'll we'll keep moving forward. Uh, 
All right, Badoo fainted. It's fine. Star is at level 5. Star is doing quick attack. That's actually kind of helpful. It's not great, but kind of helpful. Use this item, at least at the moment. All right, let's check out Star's stats. Check summary. Oh, so Star has more than half HP, so we're not going to run to the Pokemon Center, because that's the rule, because we're making things tricksy. Oh, we collecting trainer, do you want to have a go? Yes, I would love to have a go. Last sent out the doof. Quick attack. See how beefy you are. That is not beefy. That is no beef. That is oh, the, the, that that is impossible. Burger levels of not beef. I don't know if this uh, Bidoof is actually going to fight me, and I'm almost okay with that actually. I, I do think it's just going to use Defense, Curl, and Growl, and I'm arguably okay with that. It keeps me from taking damage. Um, it keeps Starly... I mean, I, I mean it, keep, it keeps the run going. Oh my gosh. Guys, I'm using the more powerful move, by the way. Like, if I were to go and use Tackle, like, it would probably do, like, half Oh my gosh, an actual move. Okay, we actually have one more sauce. Actually, no, no, we we are we are out of the the one sauces. All right. Uh Pokemon I'm 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 sure I can outlive this trainer. It'll be fine. Couple of quick attacks, it'll be fine. Oh yeah, it's against the Magikarp. Like we we have this in back because it only knows Splash. It it doesn't learn tackle until like eighteen, nineteen. So I'm just gonna tackle. I wish I had a magic card. I I truly truly do. Come on. Yeah, like I'm I'm thinking about the heat where we're at right now and like yeah, there 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 was like an initial kick to it but like nothing lasts. So I'm I'm excited to get into the into the twos okay now we can actually expect some stuff to happen okay that's not bad that that is not bad all right we lost star for another nugget let's grab shinx i'm actually gonna like use type advantage like i said we're gonna start like getting a little bit more aggressive with the playthrough. Alright, Thunder Shock. Starly is gone. Alright, we beat Youngster Tyler. Then your dad gave you crap mons. Buff those boys up. Alright, sauce number four. We have oh this one I actually have to open. We have bourbon hot sauce from New Orleans, so it's gonna be it's gonna have a bit of a Jamaican kick to it. Let's see if I can actually find the uh 
I've lost the little tear part that I need to pull. Oh, I found it. All right. Nugget. Oh my gosh, I I just way way too much on this one. Cuz I'm trying really really hard to close the lid with one hand. All right. Sauce. Yeah, that one that one does not deserve to be a a two star sauce. Like it tastes good. But mm. I got all over my hands. Should have grabbed a paper towel or something before I was doing this. Okay, okay, this one this one while it while it's not hot, it does have a lingering heat. I kind of appreciate that. Yeah, it, it, it's definitely, like, if, if you've ever had, like, jerk chicken or, like, Jamaican or, like, southern food, like, yeah, like, that's definitely the... I, I, I kept on thinking, I should have got me some, like, water or something as, like, a palate cleanser. But you know what? That's fine. Guys, we are four sauces in. We have eight to go. I'm just going to try to move my other nuggets out of, like, the pool of Jamaican hot sauce. All right. Let's see if there's any other trainers going on up here. Okay, so we can't catch it because it's still Route 204 and Dupes Claws. I would have avoided it anyway. We're gonna run. Oh, there is another trainer up here. Cool. Now here comes the suck part. The never ending wild encounters. All right. Oh, it's a Badoo! I would love a Badoo. I really love Roserade. Like, I know it's not, like, super viable and competitive, but I, I don't know. I There's just something about uh, Roserade's design that I just, I just love. So I, I do hope we get a, get a Badoo. And we're poisoned, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> oh, that's, that's actually not good. Cool. My Starly has the same problem I have. Insomnia. Oh, you're gonna heal. Okay. I'm still gonna win this match. Like, you're... You're not gonna heal enough for it to matter. And I... Like, poison is not doing enough damage right now for it to be a problem either, so... Thank you for the win. Alright. Quick attack. Alright. I think we beat this trainer? They may have one more, but I'm pretty sure it's just the one Badoo. Alright, Star is at 8, and Leroy is at 9... Okay, yeah, it was just the one. Oh, you're so strong. I got a whole $3.92 out of that. All right. Can you not? Can you just leave me alone? I, I know you have Intimidate. I know. I know. 
Okay, we're gonna run. Let's dip. Oh, come on. Can I fight? Oh, no, no. Oh, well, I, I walked past him and... Oh, let's grab you. Okay, I can't break those rocks yet. But since we're here... Oh, wait, no, no, we can't. We can't use Healy items outside of battle. Oh, this is a new route. This is a new route. Oh, we got Geodude. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, new new squad member. Welcome welcome to the team. Okay, positive thoughts. Positive thoughts. And we got Geodude. Right. Geodude will be out of the Pokedex. Many live on the mountain trails and remain half buried while keeping an eye on climbers. Would you like to give Geodude a name? Yes. G O Lady. Because that's a girl. Alright, let's check the stats of. Our new Geo dude. Gentle garbage. Spot Pokemon. All right, let's keep let's keep moving forward. Wait, Pokemon? Alright. More than half health. Alright. Let's fight a little Timmy. I'm full of energy because I get power from my Pokemon. You know what? Good, good, good for you. Good, good for you. Michael. Boy, you are disrespecting me with a Bidoof. You are... Full on disrespecting me with a Bidoof. Uh, cool, this is going to be like a nine hour match. But yeah, I hope everyone's had a good week. Uh, mine, mine was alright. Um, uh, I. I really don't have a lot to really report in the life of me, um, at least at the moment. I mean, mostly because like I'm trying really, really hard to keep my personal life separate from streamy life. But I, like I said, I still plan on streaming Hogwarts Legacy tomorrow. Depending on how things turn out tomorrow, may be the walk around Hogwarts and get a couple of like small minor things done stream. Geo Lady grew to level six, but yeah, I mean, I I still intend on on sh on streaming tomorrow and playing Hogwarts Legacy. Uh, now we're gonna keep Geo Dude out. Geo Dude's gonna be fine. Uh, tackle. Oh yeah, see, super effective move, and that still didn't do a lot. And you're too stupid to do it again. But I did get the flinch, so that is not good. Okay, Geo Lady is at half health. So we're gonna remove Geo Lady from the front of the party. All right, we lost Geo Lady, but we're gonna go in for another nugget. We're gonna grab Leroy. This is, I mean, not this fine because you're using mostly special attacks anyway. Uh, 
And I mean, we have enough of a team. I'm not going to really worry about going to the Pokemon Center just yet. I mean, it was just a Geodude. But I have, like like I said, like other and like stronger Pokemon. We're, we're going to be fine without going to the Pokemon Center just yet. Because I, I do want to progress with the actual game. But we are on to Nugget number five. And we have Japanese Wasabi. It's going to try really, really hard not to douse my entire nugget. About to clear out my sinuses. Okay, yeah, there was like th there was nothing to that. I'm actually really disappointed in the wasabi. All right, yeah, we are we are five sauces in. The nuggets are stone cold, but you know it's gonna be okay. We we will endure. Yeah, yeah, guys. See, this is this is what I mean when, like, I have to make it like extra difficult for myself because of situations like this. Because I know Cricketal has a move I can use, but like, it is actively choosing to lower my attack. Like, it like you 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 can do damage. Like that's that's fine. All right. Tur Russell's at 11 and Star is at 9. Star finally learned a flying type move. Youngster Dallas. Got some money for winning. I'm just going to respond to a quick message. All right, battle. Bidoof, please you. All right, one hit KO. We, we like those. No, because we ain't no babies. I'm too strong. All right. I think this is your last mon. Growth isn't going to help you. Like, yeah, go ahead and raise your attack. Like, you're not going to be able to really attack me next turn. Like, there will be no next turn for you. All right, we beat Caitlyn. Yeah, because I'm at, like, level 10, and you're at, like, 4s and 5s. Keep the ball rolling. I was really confused for like half a second. I'm like, why is my Pokemon red? I'm like, oh, that's right. Uh, Starly is poisoned. Actually, 
actually what I'm gonna do is next turn. Actually, now it'll be fine. I, I was gonna use Leaf Edge because normal type moves only do half damage to fighting types, but I am so far ahead with a plus nature for physical attacks that like I'm not actually afraid. Alright, just as I thought, we're gonna win. Alright, there's one more trainer up here. Uh, it doesn't matter that you have a badge, like you're 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 going down. Madeline? Madeline? Maydeen? Yeah, 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 yeah. Your 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 star means nothing to me. Now, if you're actually no, I don't think you'll know wing attack yet. Never mind. I was gonna ask you to use wing attack. Nope. Because I am confident enough in my. Abilities to just defeat you with Kurt Russell. There's really no need for me to switch. Alright. Cool. I beat you with no actual... Okay, cool. Give me a rock smash. Give me. Wait, is it rock smash? I don't think it's rock smash. It is rock smash. Okay. Okay, yeah, yeah. Okay. Cool. Okay, uh, we have hidden moves that we can use um, without actually needing to put the moves on Pokemon. It's going to be super, super helpful. Um, after this battle, I need to check something real quick. I need to be able to make sure that I can actually catch a Pokemon in this route. And not dupes, because I did just catch a Pokemon in a cave relatively close. And Sinnoh has, like, one big mountain area. And so I just want to make sure that I don't accidentally uh, just catch the wrong... Well, catch Pokemon I'm not allowed to have. So let's get this battle over with. Do it, Kurt Russell, I believe. Alright, Star is now at level 10. Alright, Curtis, you have been defeated. Insufficiently raised. Yes, completely insufficiently raised. Alright, let's check uh, Geo Lady. Pokemon. You are at the top. Check summary. Uh, on the Ravaged Path. Oh, nope, not Pokedex. Town map. Okay, I'm on 203? Okay. I think I got something for 203. Okay, we don't have anything for 203. Okay, we can catch something in here. If it's dupes, okay, it's dupes. We're just gonna, we're, we're we're just gonna move forward. We're not gonna waste time trying to trying to catch something. So we're gonna just run and we're gonna fight the other trainer.
Yeah, we can celebrate you getting through the cave by losing to me. That's that is a hundred percent okay. That is a hundo percent okay. I do think we're gonna go through a lot of sauces in the gym battle just because I I'm I'm under leveled. And I kinda did that intentionally because this 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 is a one off stream. Like I'm not gonna make like a whole series out of this. Alright, let's go. Ooh, Psyduck. I'm gonna give you a headache. I still find it really, really interesting that... Psyduck learns, like, a bunch of Psychic-type moves, and Psyduck and Golduck's Pokedex entries, like, make, like, reference having Psychic abilities, but it is just Water-type. You see, I want, like, in a future Pokemon game, now that they're making, like, regional variations of Pokemon, to have, like, a future region Psyduck-Golduck that's part Psychic, so it'll finally make sense. Speaking of Psychic-types and regional variants. I love Alone and Raichu because it gains its psychic abilities by eating pancakes. Howdy, trainer. If you don't have a single gym badge or other trainers look down on you, you're a total noob, right? So I'll show you what the town's Pokemon gym is. Yeah, like, I don't even like pancakes, but just knowing that a Pokemon gains psychic abilities by eating pancakes, that brings me a lot of joy. Huh, there's someone here. Yeah, it's ADHD. Oh, it's you, Mr. Fence. You finally got here. You're slow like always. Yeah, because I'm in the middle of doing things. You're so slow, the gym leader is long gone now. He said he'd go, oh yeah, to the mines. I got my badge already, so it's no big deal to me, but... Alright, let's actually... You know, we, 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 we can get through the mines, alright. Because it's, it's not that big of a mine. We can catch them on. And we can... Go f go fight the gym. Like that's that that's goal. Okay. Um, we're just gonna run from you, dupes claws. I probably should have picked up that item because I think it's an escape rope, which will make my life significantly easier. Oh, can I fight you guys? Oh nope. Alright. Okay, I can fight you. Okay. Because I do want to get a little bit of experience before we go into the gym. Like, even if I have to eat more nuggies to get the experience for some other mons. Um, just, just because I, I want to go and at least a little bit more first. Like, I know the run's probably going to end after the gym battle, and I'm, I'm okay with that. Like I said, this is just like a one-off thing, but I, I want to feel at least a little bit better. Alright, we got one more. Wow, even with the lowering of my defense, that still did, like, actually nothing. Thank you for the crit. It's unnecessary, but I appreciate. Okay, we got no level ups from that. It's fine, we got, got some money? Ooh, are you gonna be what I want? You are practically free money. Because again, we can only heal at Pokemon Centers, and we can only heal at a Pokemon Center if we have at least a Pokemon with less than half health. Um, I know I have the the fainted Geo Lady right now, but I, like I said, like there's the gym leader. So we're gonna talk to the gym leader. We're gonna go up. We're gonna heal them. We're gonna go fight the gym. Oh, stand back and watch this. Using the hit and move rock smash to get rid of the boulder blocking your way. Bottom boulders need to be smashed so they're out of the way. If you could get the badge from the gym in town, you'd be able to do this too. Of course, you have to beat the gym leader first, and that'd be me. All right, let's go run into wild Pokemon. 
because that's that's that is our lives. Okay, we can catch a Zubat. It's not what I want, because I hate Zubats, but it's fine. Alright. I'm going to do the obligatory mashing of the L and R buttons, because we have this false sense of it actually increasing our chances of catching them on. Alright, should get a level up for Leroy. Okay, cool. Leroy got a level up. And Star and Turt Russell are pretty close as well. Uh, yeah, we have to call, give you a name. I'm going to call you Zuzu. Is it creative? No. Zuzu has been added to our party. Okay. And we are just about there. All right, let's heal. And the weird thing with this gym is you can actually skip like the first two trainers and just go straight to the gym leader. Um, I'm not going to do that. Just because, like I said, I would like a little bit more experience before going in and fighting. Because, like I said, while I'm pretty sure it's going to end after this gym leader, I'd rather it not. Well, after this gym. Um, so let's let's go get our first badge. You avoid the long way around and see why you do that. Because I want to eat my cold nuggets and get some experience. There is your answer. That youngster Jonathan sent out Geodude. All right, roll out. You're going to be stuck in there for a while. That's 100% fine. As long as you, like, miss... And I'm 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 not gonna pop out of the. Actually, no. I, I, I like I'll. If a if a mon faints, I will go and heal up. Okay, so we we're we're gonna grab at least one more sauce. All right, there's two sauces. All right, Geodude's gone. Turret's at 13. Uh, yeah, we'll forget. Let's draw. And we beat Youngster Jonathan. All right. So we are going for two sauces. All right. Uh, sauce number one, we have... Cayenne hot sauce from Africa. See if I can find the. Oh, there it is. Garbage under the desk. Guys, like, I'm feeding these nuggets, and they feel like they've just been pulled out of the freezer and just. Oh, oh, we're spilling again. 
I mean, again, at least it's on a plate. And kind of on my hands. All right. Nugget. I mean, it tastes good, but it's definitely not a two-star. Oh, guys, guys. Oh, we have one more two-star. We have one more two-star heat. And that's what we're going to try next. It is the green chili from India. that there is that yeah that yeah those last two actually no that one I mean, like it—it it tastes good, but there, there's there's no there's no offensive kick to it yet, which I'm 100% fine with. All right, guys, we are we have five flavors left, and we are officially out of the two star rankings for the for the heat. Um, so far. I've noticed a lot of like the ones have a bit more kick to it than than the than the twos. Um, the twos kind of have a longer lasting burn. That may be what they're going for. And I I, I do kind of appreciate that. Like I don't like don't get me wrong. I love hot things. I love spicy things. But I hate things that like have no like flavor to them. But they're just hot. Like that's all that the manufacturer cared about was just being hot. And like I'm, I'm not gonna give you like this food review on like all the hot sauces. I'm, I'm gonna, you know, give you like a brief summary of like what it's like. But yeah, like th that last one, like it definitely tasted like like a, a green chili you would taste in in a curry, and it's pretty good. I would probably even have it on like tacos. Like I said, the stream is over if we can no longer save a Pokemon or we run out of hot sauces. Or if it's too hot that my like I'm in physical pain. I'm pretty sure we're gonna get to that in this gym. I I am I am fairly confident. I would love it if you used a move that actually did damage. Good sir. Because you can only get to plus... Oh, you did an attack. Thank you. But did nothing. Alright. I'm... Um, Breaking one of my internal rules. We are, yeah, we're we're swapping out. If you're not gonna do anything, I'm, I'm not gonna waste people's time. So you can do defense curl until the cows come home. Like that's, like it's not only boring, but it's it's just frustrating. All right. Level up. Uh, nah, it's not much of a point.
All right, all right. Finally, a a damage move. Thank you. I I actually do appreciate that. I am again sick and tired of your not doing anything offensively. All right, Geo Lady is at eight, and Star is at eleven. We are still woefully under level for the first gym. It's fine. I believe in us. And it is a decent way for us to kind of just wrap up the evening. I'm Rourke, the gym leader. I'm but one trainer who decided to walk proudly with rock-type Pokemon. As the gym leader, I need to see your potential as a trainer, and I need to see the toughness of the Pokemon that battle with you. You'll be seeing something. I'm not sure what, but you will be seeing something. I know you guys can't hear the music, but I kind of like the gym leader music in this. Bruh. Gross. It's okay for you to attack me. You know what? I'm going to take a risk. Save my Geo Lady. I want to see if I can if I can taunt them. Okay, that's kind of what I was hoping for. I was hoping to taunt you into a rollout. I think this only boosts special. I kind of hope it boosts physical as well. Okay, just my special defense. All right, so we we lost Leroy, hundred percent fine. Let's go back into Geo Lady. Stealth rocks are gonna be kind of annoying, but you know that's fine. So for those of you who don't know rollout, it gets, it hurts more each successive hit, and as soon as you miss, it starts over again. I wanna, I I wanna see if I can luck out, get them to miss, and get an absorb out. Oh, I'm even faster. That's nice. Not enough to do me any good. Alright, so there are three sauces. Alright, battle. Okay, we we got we got Geo dude. Guys, we might actually get out of the first gym in semi one piece. Guys, we beat the first gym and we didn't lose our entire team. That's fantastic. Which means the run keeps going. Oh wait, there's one more Pokemon. Okay, okay. Guys, I got really excited for like two seconds. Yeah, that's fine. All right, that is, I believe, four sauces. All 
All right, guys, we are trying uh, the rest of the sauces. As soon as we unfortunately white out and wake up in the gym. All right, guys, I am incredibly terrified. All right, heal the team. Actually, yeah, let's just let's, let's let's heal. Let's let's heal the squad. The funny thing is, is like I don't have to eat the hot sauce. I for all five months, I I could technically just eat the hot sauce for the ones I actually want to live and let the other ones die and keep the challenger running. But we ain't gonna do that. I got cold nuggies. All right, in honor. In honor of of Geo Lady, we are having habanero hot sauce from España. Oh, guys, I am I am I am terrified. Oh, come on! I got rid of my nails the other day, so I have like nothing to into this. Alright. Oh no! No, that went to that went to the favorite's birth <laughs> I mean Christmas present. Crap. I'm gonna have to dig that out before I forget. Alright. Habanero from España. Got the dot. Ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, we are finishing in hot sauce territory. I repeat, we are in hot sauce territory. And we got four more to go. From Laos, we got the Asian hot sauce. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. oh my god. Oh. Oh, like I get like my my tongue is burning. All right. Laos, you let me down. There was no heat. Yeah, Laos, Laos, you you let me down. Like I don't know if it's because like I just ate the España. There's nothing to that. Okay, Thailand, mango habanero. Okay, this one I have I have expectations with. All right. Okay, that one actually doesn't really smell bad. Nugget. Still in the three stars. Okay. 
that. Nothing to it. It's actually really, really disappointing. I mean, again, it, it still, it still tastes good. It still tastes good. But okay, Malawi peri peri hot sauce. Folks, we're officially in the hottest of the hot territory. There's only two of these. I, I'm at the point where like I'm gonna like do a little sniff test, you know, see what to expect, and like I'm I'm hoping to clear some sinuses out of this. Here's the little bottle. Okay, this one actually kind of scares me. You got the dip. Okay, I, I do think my my taste buds are just gone at this point. Because that one doesn't like actually have like it has a kick to it, but I, I would have put it down like a two or maybe a three star, but it it is definitely not yeah, I mean actually comfortably put into like a two star. Alright. Last bottle. Last nugget. Tanzania, very hot sauce. I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, see it's supposed to say very hot. The official sniffy. If I can actually open the stupid thing. Oh, come on. Alright. Nuggy. Got on my hand again. Okay. Tanzania wins. Oh. Oh, like it, it, it doesn't numb, it doesn't numb me at all, but it, it's definitely a little bit better than the, uh, the, uh, the España. All right, guys, that's going to be it for tonight. Guys, thank you so much for tuning in. Still plan on seeing you guys tomorrow. Hope you have a great day. Have a great evening. Bye.